Hey guys, uh, back here, same job. I was just moving the, shooting the base position in. I was just gonna show you how to set this base up. Um, so you can see right now, I now have the base on my pole. Got my rover back on my rod. I have my rover turned off. You don't have to do that, but I think it's best practice just to have it off. You can't accidentally connect to the wrong one. Be lying if I said I never did it. So, I'll go in here. My base is powered on. See Bluetooth running, so on and so forth. So I go set up, GPS base station. So now I'm gonna use a known control point instead of an unknown point. So now I have my base pole in here, okay. Got my base pole, so we're just gonna hit next. So back to the zero antenna height. I always use a zero antenna height because I don't care about the point on the ground. The point I'm trying to repeat is up top there. So I use zero antenna height. Radio settings, I'm not gonna get into that. They're, they're the same, I'm running UHF radios. <laughs> Uh, using all the satellite constellations I can out here. So now I'm going to connect to my base. Nice thing there about having your rover turned off, you accidentally hit the wrong one. It's not going to connect. I mean, not the end of the world if you do, but why create problems? So, so base started okay. Bluetooth disconnected.